Well, my name is William Harrison Polk, and this is this will be my video for the new student dialogue that I had to do. Um, but first, I'm going to start out with some normal facts about me. I am from Greenville, South Carolina, good old G Vegas. Um, I'm a freshman, obviously, since I'm in CU 1000, but I'm also an architecture major. It's a pretty hard major, so I'm pretty pretty proud to be in there. Since yeah, it's pretty hard. But first, we start out with. 80 students then went to 60 so I guess a lot of people dropped out got tired of it but um I am 18 years old right now I came into college 17 so I was pretty much a youngin so there's a couple of my friends that did that too so not many of us but I love baseball and football so that's kind of a plus come to Clemson because since we're so good at both right now we are number six I think so yeah that's, that's a plus of going to a great school like this and also as you can tell I am uh, not shaven at all it's the middle of no shave November so I gotta keep it going but yeah I guess that's enough about, uh, information about me I'll go ahead and talk about the new student dialogue um, I guess I'll just go off this sheet I made it's got some stuff to talk about since it was a little while ago so just go just go off this but I, the class I took was, am I a good person, based on religion, morals, that kind of stuff. Um, it was in about mid-October, the day we got back from fall break, actually. Well, I guess it was a good start back. Um, first, when I got there, I showed up about 10 minutes early. I was the only one there, so I was kind of worried that I was in the wrong class, but luckily I wasn't. People started showing up. Um, First, when everybody showed up, we did a little connection circle based on, well, we said one, like, the first person would say a fact about themselves, and if someone had anything to do with it, they would say connection, and they'd be connected. And of course, since my nervous self, I don't like to talk very much, so I was the very last person, well, second to last person, and I had to say a fact about me, and the last person had to be connected to me, and I listed about five or six facts wasn't connected at all so it was pretty funny but then I said I'm a Clemson fan so he, he was connected to that so that went pretty well I guess but then we uh, just read some information about dialogues what they are compared to normal discussions I still don't really know what a dialogue is but that's alright um, after that after we did that we kind of they kind of just summed up what the dialogue would be about just like I said just based on religion morals what that kind of stuff if we're a good person but I grew up being a Southern Baptist but also a Baptist in the middle of the Bible belt so I guess I'm where I should be um, all my life I've thought I've had good morals thought I was a good person, I've always been told I'm a pretty good person based on the way I act, my school work, that kind of, that kind of stuff, so I guess you can count myself, as, well, I can count myself as a good person, but I don't know, I guess you'd have to tell me if you ever met me, um, but it, it was pretty, it was a pretty good dialogue because there was a bit a wide variety of people in the class, not everybody was religious like me. Um, some people didn't have the greatest morals, some people did, it was, it was just a good variety to talk with different people, but, um, then we, towards the middle of the dialogue, we created a timeline through our whole lives from when we first were born to now, what we did, like, our actions, that kind of stuff, and we showed, we got into groups of two, three, maybe four, and discussed it with each other, and let them decide if we were a good person, but it didn't really matter because we're always taught to not think or not really care what other people say about us. But it was kind of nice getting feedback on what other people thought about us. So I guess that was pretty good. Um, but yeah, I had a good group. We were all raised as Southern Baptist Christians. Kind of departed from that for a little bit, but came back just because. We're teenagers, what do you expect? We're not going to be the greatest people out there, but I've been working on it, so hopefully it's been pretty well. Um, 
And some other questions were, should I be, or should I be considered a good person based on my morals, religion, that kind of stuff. Um, but my views were always religion, no, well, it's not really, but, mm, like a lot of people think that you can only be a good person based on your morals. I don't really believe that because I think if you're a good Christian person, you're a pretty good person, but that's not what, not always the case because I know a ton of Christians that aren't the best people, but I guess morals kind of do have a say in it, but yeah. That was about most of the whole student dialogue, and I guess that will wrap up this video. So thank you if you watch it, and I will be seeing you all around. I'm Harrison Polk once again, freshman architecture major, a stud. I'll see you all later.